Hello, I made cheesecake for you. This is how it looks finished and I'm gonna show you how I made it later on. My wife uh, gave me an idea about the fruit toppen and it's a cheesecake made out of cork cheese. Cork cheese that I made myself before I made the cheesecake. Cork cheese is very simple to make. All you need is some kind of souring agent, in my case lemon juice and uh, milk. That's it. You don't need anything else to make a cork cheese. Later on, when I was making cork cheese, I added some milk. I mean, uh, not to the cork cheese, when I was making cheesecake, I added some milk because the custard of cheese, eggs and flour was a little too dense. This cheesecake is not for the people with a huge sweet tooth because it's not really that sweet. It's very little sugar, some little sweetener and it's almost savory. But to me, it's delicious. I hope that you enjoy and uh, next, uh, the way I made the cheesecake. Hello, how are you? And today I'm only using two ingredients, lemon juice and milk. And I already put them into the pot and uh, I put milk into the pot and then I put lemon juice to sour the milk and I left the milk for an hour to sour and to create curds. And that's how I'm making cork cheese, Tvarukin Polish. It's a traditional Polish cheese and uh, it's uh, very simple and it has supposed to be heated but it's not supposed to be boiled. Therefore over here it's already soured and right now I'm starting little heat to uh, make it start cooking and pretty much I'm gonna be back when it's gonna be done. Thank you. Hello, how you doing? So this is the finished product with uh, one tablespoon of, uh, uh, of sugar and right now I'm gonna put, uh, it's gonna, all gonna be gluten free. So uh, first of all, uh, one cup of uh, the flour and two eggs. So I'm gonna crack the eggs first. And I'm gonna put the flour in. So that's pretty much finished. And now I'm gonna blend it together. You stop. little too dense so we're gonna add some milk one second please so I'm adding a little milk very little not to make it too too thin So this is finished product. I'm gonna be using gluten-free from store bottom for it. Okay. So now that's how it looks, the bottom. And right now I'm gonna start pouring in the bottom, the top, the custard. Now I'm gonna put it in the oven. So this is how the uh, 
cheesecake looks after it has been cooked and before the topping was put on it. And the other cheesecake looks pretty much the same. I do not know if you saw what I'm using, but uh, this is what I'm using and also this. That's pretty much it. So I'm uh, making right now, I'm making a topping for the cheesecake and I'm making it out of blueberries and uh, out of mango chunks. Uh, one came from Lidl, the other one came from Walmart. So that's pretty much, and it's over here. It's with uh, little sugar and sweetener and it's with little lemon juice and it's a mango. And Okay. 